recap. New game. Alright. I guess I don't need the recap. Recommended mode. Yeah, I guess that's what I'll do. Dear Shenhua, my work is done. The phoenix entrusted to our people is now complete. The time of destiny has come. Go with the one who holds the phoenix, Shenhua, and find the proof. Yield yourself to the light and go together. I shall give you the family treasure the Sword of Seven Stars. Think of the sword as a part of me, and keep it with you. I shall always watch over you. What the...? Ryo! Right. Dragon and a phoenix. Just like the mirrors. So this is what he was working on. From a distant land in the east, from across the sea, he shall appear. He does not know of the strength hidden within him. The strength that would destroy him. The strength that would fulfill his wishes. When he is ready, he shall seek me out. And we shall brave together the rocky path. I shall wait. This encounter has been my destiny since ancient times. A dragon shall emerge from the earth, and dark clouds shall obscure the heavens. A phoenix shall descend from above. Its wings will create a purple wind. In the midst of the pitch black night, a morning star shall glisten, alone. What is that poem? It has been told in the village since long ago. The one who holds the phoenix. Bailu Village. We might find some clues about my father there. Let's go. Sure. Hey, Shenhua. We have to get to the village. Let's go. Do you have any idea where your father might have gone? No, I don't. Hmm. Has this ever happened before? With my father? Yeah. Has he ever disappeared without telling you? No, never. I see. Are you certain 
That letter from the cave was... It's his handwriting, without a doubt. Okay. Are you sure it didn't contain any clues? Um... Shenhua? I don't know. Honestly, I don't care about the letter. I just want to find my father. I understand. All right, Shenmue 3. Well, oh, let me try to fix this in the options. All right, how do you go to options? Okay. options alright well I played the Shenmue 1 and 2 I had a lot of fun driving the forklift around in the first one A lot of fun with the uh, the second half of the of Shenmue 2. That was probably my favorite part when you go to Wanzai. All right, um, can I run somehow? Maybe. Oh, oh, here are the settings. Game mode you can change. Change clothes. Display mode. Zoom on. Alright. Subtitles on. Okay, I guess that's it. Hmm. Capsule sets. Items, key items, food. Alright. Okay, that was a uh, right bumper. Alright. Ooh, it's, it's a, a camera mode or something? Can I take a picture? I don't know. Alright. Try clicking the sticks, they don't help. They don't. Alright. X button. Maybe I can't run yet. I hope the game lets me run. This is kind of slow. Xinhua, who's this? This is Liu. He saved me from drowning in the river. <clears throat> Did something happen? 
A group of thugs tore through here two days ago. Oh no, really? Yeah, the kind we don't normally see around here. Let's keep moving. Hey, Shenhua. What's the matter? Does the village usually have gatekeepers? No. There's no need for them. Bailu is a very peaceful place. Are you sure about that? Because they said some thugs came by. Yes, but it sounds like they're not from around here. Still, that's worrying. Even for you? Yeah. I admit, I'm a little unsettled myself. The village feels different somehow. I can imagine. Let's ask around for some clues. Let's go. That was a pretty old bridge. Indeed. That's the Verdant Bridge. That's what it's called. Yes. It's been in Bailu for a while. Is that the village? Up ahead? Yes. Everyone lives up ahead. We can ask around. Someone's bound to know something. Let's not waste another second. All right, let's not waste another second. I'm gonna look around. Let's go back this way. Oh, there's run. Maybe I couldn't do it before, I don't know. It's right trigger on the pad, okay. All right, this is a very old bridge. Guess I'll go after Shenhua. <laughs> okay. Anything over here? Probably not. All the way in the corner. Hmm, fishing. Maybe I can go fishing here later. What does that mean? Try pressing some buttons on it. Nope, no, nope, wrong button. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, Shenhua. Just want to look around a bit. Ooh, that's what I want to find. Yeah. I have to go with Shenhua. What? No. Ah. Okay. All right. I'm going to lose sight of Shenhua. I'd better hurry. Okay. Which way did she go? I lost sight of her. <laughs> there you are. Hmm. <laughs> Ah, more vending machines. Kung Fu practice. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find out more about your father. Thanks. You investigate here, Liu. I'll try another settlement. Hmm. There's more than one settlement here. Thought it was just one small village. Alright. What is that? Something new? 
Two men stood guard at the bridge. Thugs appeared in the village. Shenhua left the village square without me. Ask the villagers about Wan. Okay. Alright. Hey, kid. Oh. Alright. Talk. I need help with something. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? Nope. Yen. All I care Yen. about is martial arts. Okay then. Mm -mm. Alright, let's talk to this guy. If I can. Maybe he's too busy. Hey. Uh. I need help with something. Have you seen Mr. Yuen? Yuen. I don't know. Hmm. Really? I don't know anything. I see. <laughs> Man, she don't know anything. Why am I asking her? I feel like the old man over there sitting down probably knows something. Excuse <laughs> me. What is it? Have you seen Mr. Yuen? He occasionally came to visit Joe next door, but Joe is likely working right now. Maybe Joe's daughter Lean knows Joe. where he is. I see. Food. Oh. Hmm. Right. I don't need anything right now. There's something I want to ask. <coughs> Have you seen Mr. Yuan? Where did you come from, young man? What? There's always something interesting coming in from the Lijiang River. I wonder what's going to show up next. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Do I have any money? All right. I'll give it a try. I'll give it a try. Where's my money? Okay, I got 200. One times five. Alright. Uh, this is like fishing lures. Oh, wait, that cost 10, I think. What was that? Oh, that's that guy from the first this one. This is cool. Yeah. This is cool. Mm hmm. Let's play some more. Oh, I'm spending so much money. This is great. Ah, oh, I got that one already. I see. I see. Yeah, I'm not. I'm too, not too happy with that. All right. I need to figure out how to make more money. I need help with something. What do you want? I'm looking for someone named Yuan. Yuan. No, I haven't. Not since I saw him go to that house over there. But that was a while ago. Okay, thanks. Hmm. Go to that house over there. Right. I walk in here. Hey. And who might you be? You're not a face I recognize. I've got a question. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? I'm sorry, dear, but could you save that for later? This is no place for idle chit-chat. Hmm. Okay.
Is anyone there? Uh, looks like no one's home. All right, no one's home. Looks like the path is blocked here. I should talk to more people around here. Yeah. Okay. Hello? Uh, it seems nobody's home. Hello? Uh, looks like no one's home. Hmm. Oh, I can't get I can't get over there. All right. All right, let's finish talking to these villagers. I can't go down here. looks great. <laughs> yep, Shenhua tells me that too. You know Shenhua? She's my friend. Is she your friend too? <laughs> yeah, she is. Say, do you know Mr. Yin? Uh, no. He's a stonemason. Stonemason, just like my daddy. Your dad is a stonemason as well? Yep. Can I talk to him? Uh huh. He comes home at seven at night. Hmm, he does. What if he also go by a different name? Okay, thanks. Mm -hmm. Something. No problem. That sounds like him. Jump. Oh. Huh. Select destination jump. Huh. To Lin's house. That's convenient. Pardon me. Who's there? May I talk to you for a moment? What is it? Oh, hi, mister. You know this man? He's my friend, daddy. Well, get to it. I haven't seen Yuen around. If you know anything, I... Huh? What happened? Some thugs I'd never seen before showed up and wrecked my place. Thugs, huh? Why would they do this? It's me. They asked if I was a stonemason, so I said yes. And they just went crazy. Why stonemasons? They were definitely looking for something. What did they look like? Well, they weren't from around here, that's for sure. There were two of them. One had a shaved head with a tattoo on it. 
Don't tell me. They went to Yuan's place too? I don't know. Yuan was in the quarry when he disappeared. You're kidding. Those thugs might have something to do with that too. Maybe. I'll be sure to tell Shenhua. All right. Oh. It's gotten so dark. Yeah, now what? Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. Okay. Yeah, where's Shenhua's house? I'll just go right there. Oh. Have you learned <laughs> anything new, Ryo? Not about your father, no. I see. It seems that the thugs invaded Mr. Joe's home, though. Joe, you mean Ling's house? They must have my father, then. We shouldn't jump to conclusions. I'm going with you tomorrow. What? I can't stop thinking about these thugs. I want to know more. All right, then. We'll go together. Good. All right. Shenhua's house. Let's look around. Oh, I guess not. Okay. Just needed a cutscene to uh, have him take his shoes off. <laughs> All right. All right. And there's nothing to do up here. Walk back down. I can't look over here. Nothing to do. Okay. Is that like her bedroom? Leo? Yeah? I've been thinking about the thugs that went to Ling's house. And Ling. I don't think it was a coincidence. I'm with you. They must have had a reason. Let's talk to the villagers together tomorrow. Okay. I want to ask some questions of my own. Alright. Can I get any food? Um. Hey, Shenhua. What is it, Liao? Did your father say anything to you? You know, before he left? <clears throat> no, nothing. But that wasn't unusual. Hmm. Okay. Although... Although what? Now that I think about it, he turned back to look at me several times as he headed for the cave. Interesting. Maybe he had a feeling he wouldn't be coming back. Man. I wanted to get one more look. All right. Where does this go? Okay, this goes back out. Right here. I can just go hang out all night, I guess. Well, I don't know about that. It might make me go back to my room after a while. Okay, let's go sleep.
Maybe I should have saved it first. Oh well. Okay, the thugs act like they own the village. Maybe they have something to do with the UN being gone. Alright. Let's go ask around with Sh Shenhua. Okay. Where is she? Back in the kitchen. Alright. Hmm, it's kind of early, but are you ready to go? Good morning, Leo. Good morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. All right, why is it why is that flashing? Okay. Hold the left trigger and look for curious spots to check out. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. That's it. Okay, just look in there. All right. Anything else? Just looking around in our drawers here. All right. Oh, there's a lot. There's a lot to look through. Oh boy. All right. Ooh. Can I grab those? Chocolate. Seems they've got it all. Oh, I can't get one, huh? I can't steal the chocolate. <laughs> uh, alright. Yeah, just some pans. Okay. Oh, there's a lot to look through here. I don't want to miss anything though. Alright, just some forks. Look everywhere over here. Uh, it's, a, it's a banana. Okay. A banana. Do they grow them in the village? Guess I'll take it. Ah, uh, I guess I'll take it. All right, I have a banana. I have an apple too. Looks good. Guess yeah. I'll <laughs> All right, I got some food now.
some spices. Is that pepper? There's enough to last a millennium. Oh, take one. Ah. Oh, take one, yeah. Is that? Oh, I'm just looking. All right. All right, back out of that drawer. Look at the bottom one. All right. What's in this bag? Ah, somebody to look through. Is this Shenhua when she was little? That's probably Yuren in the back. <laughs> oh man. Hmm. Maybe I'll look through those later. It's getting late. Alright, let me save it. Alright, saved it. Um, ready to go? Hey, Xinhua. Yes? It's time to make our way to the village. Okay. We can talk more on the way. <laughs> it's time to go. Rio. Let's go. Yeah. Your house is pretty far from the village, huh, Shenhua? Oh, yes, I suppose you're right. Is there a reason for that? The quarry could be one. Sorry? The quarry. It's a special one that even I'm not allowed to enter. Ah. So, your house is there to protect it? Yes, I believe so. Father didn't tell me anything about it, though. I see. 
Do you know what the dragon and phoenix and the quarry were for? No, I don't. But your father carved them, right? <coughs> yes, he must have. He wasn't alone, though. What do you mean by that? They must have taken generations to complete. So, you think your grandfather worked on them too? Yes, possibly even further back than that. Have you heard any stories about them? Not a single one. My father always <coughs> said he'd tell me when I got older. Then, how do you know it has so much history? Well, everyone in the village has history. The villagers? Yes. Generations of stonemasons, hunters, and farmers have all lived here. The same goes for the cattle wranglers. They've been here for ages. Oh, yeah? That's just how things work here. she go I lost her all right where are they going here Is this a dojo? That's right. This is Marshall Hall. It's been here for ages. Marshall Hall? Long ago, many great martial artists traveled here, from all over the world. <laughs> but no one comes here nowadays. Is that so? Ryo, you should come here to practice when you have time. Is that... Okay. Of course. Our doors are open to everyone that comes here looking to master the martial arts. Are you a new trainee? Sorry? Hmm, you're Japanese. I am. The people of Bailu Village have trained here for centuries. It has history. Did you say centuries? You would do well to train here if you have lost sight of the path. You can polish your techniques. So you'll let me train here? Not only that, I'll let you prove yourself by fighting the monks here. You're on. <laughs> A fight? Very well. Your first opponent shall be Red Tiger. He is our least skilled monk, but do not underestimate him. All right, just hit the A, B, X, Y buttons. Try pressing the right trigger. Eat and fill up before fighting. Well, it's too late now. say you will you join us yes absolutely very well what is your name <coughs> yo hazuki i shall have a name tag prepared for you you will start from the lowest rank rank yes you must fight and defeat someone above your rank in order to move up you must train day in and day out to improve your kung fu all right. 
Oh, all I did was randomly press some attack buttons and... Guess I'll go after Shenhua. Alright, I kept hitting that tornado kick a lot. I want to do more. Alright, Shenhua. Alright, here we are at the bridge again. Whose shop is that? Over the bridge. Oh, it belongs to Uncle Tao. Uncle Tao, huh? Yes, people can get anything they need from his shop. I see. Leo, did you pack anything to eat? Why do you ask? Well, you can't run on an empty stomach. That's a very good point. Be sure to keep a little something on hand in case you get hungry later. A lot of places in the village sell food, too. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Yeah, I got a banana and apple to eat. How do I eat? Uh. Food, there we go. Alright, I got some garlic, pears, that, that new banana, okay. Um, <laughs> Alright. Leo, the herb. <laughs> this is... It's licorice. Mm. You can make Chinese medicine with it. So, you can turn this into medicine, huh? Not just this. There are lots of herbs growing in Bailu. Where do they grow? They're all over the place, but you have to really look for them. Oh, really? There should be special maps at Uncle Tao's shop. Someone actually made maps? Yes, if you find enough to make some medicine, Uncle Tao will buy them from you. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind. Mm, pick it up. Alright. Licorice. All right, all right, Shenhua. Let's go talk to some people. Hmm. Which way? Hmm. Jump system. Okay. I guess I can't use it now. All right. I would like to know, what's the tall tower just past the village square? Uh, yes, that's the bell tower. What is it for? We ring the bell if there's a fire in the mountains, or if something dangerous is encroaching on the village. Is that why it's so tall? Precisely. 
It's also a useful landmark, because you can see it from anywhere in the village. That's handy. So you can find your way back to the square, if you head for the bell tower? That's right. I'll have to keep that in mind. <laughs> the bell tower. I want to go check it out and ring the bell. Hey, you teach kung fu? Want to spar? Excuse me. <laughs> oh, hey kid. What do you want? Kid, man. Have you come to apprentice under me? Huh? I don't know. Oh, nothing. <laughs> a beginner, right? You have a name? Ryo Hazuki. Well, Ryo, it's your lucky day. Fear not, for I am the great Suza Xiong. I can forge a formidable master out of the most hopeless of pupils. You stand before a Chun Tai cheer master. Um, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> like you don't God. trust him. You don't think I've got what it takes? That's not what I... Then let me show you what I've got. Fight me, right now. Oh, man. Look, I'm not opposed, but... It's too late now, R It was Ryo, right? All right, man. Kick. He, he won't do the the kick anymore if I press right trigger. Why? Oh, I'm not trying to do that. Why did it, why did it force me to do something? The controls aren't the same as before. Ugh. Hmm. Thanks for that. Well, how's it feel? Pretty nice to train with a master like me, isn't it? Hmm. Uh, sure. Come by any time. I'm always up for a fight. How about right now? Hi there. So Just don't get what the game wanted me to do. What gives, young lady? <laughs> Have we met or something? It's me, Shen Hua. Shen Hua? Shen Hua. Look at you! You've grown like a weed since we last met. Have you seen the thugs that came here recently? Thugs, huh? I'll help you get rid of them. They don't call me the Lu Bu of Bai Lu Village for nothing. Zhe Xiang. Did you say Lu Bu? Wasn't he a bit of a thug himself? Wait, what? You sure? Well, you might have noticed, but this ain't no freaking school. Right. Alright. Hi there. You haven't seen any thugs, have you? They don't call me the Zhang Fei of Bai. Right, I see. Goodness. Okay. But you, you teach kung fu too? You wanna fight? I need help with something. <laughs> I have nothing to say to a stranger. Can I talk to you about something? Sh Shenhua, w what's up? This is Liu. He's a friend of mine. For real? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did you see any thugs come here? 
No, but I heard some other people talking about it. Seems like some people got their homes trashed. Okay, thanks. Actually, I'm more worried about Yuran than those thugs. Thanks, Mingyong. Oh, uh, don't mention it. I'm just, you know. Okay. Yeah, I can't talk to him. Probably not. Right. Ooh. Excuse me. Oh, hello. Lucky How hit. About a game of lucky hit. Um. Come on, come on, try it. Not right now. Oh. Oh. I want to. So you don't like lucky hit? This kind of based on luck. <laughs> Alright. I wanna see if I can ring that bell. I've got to eat something. Oh? <laughs> if you run while your health is in the yellow, your health will deplete quickly and you won't be able to run. Interesting. Alright. Food. Huh. Okay. Maybe I'll talk to a few folks around here. Alright, I can't go over there yet. I talked to you the other day. Excuse me. Oh, oh. oh what have we here? Looks like it's a young man this time. Um, there's always something interesting coming in from the Lijiang River. Oh, you said that before. Huh? Uh, first a tree, then a goat. I wonder what's going to show up next. Hey. <laughs> Mr. Jiang, there's something we'd like to ask you. <laughs> if it isn't Shenhua... Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Thugs, eh? Well, now that you mention it, I did see a group of shifty-looking strangers. They barged in at night and gave me their evil <laughs> eye. What did they want? Who knows? They quickly left without saying anything. I see. They just came Thank in and you, gave Mr. him the Jung. evil eye, huh? And then they left quickly. <laughs> All right. I need help with something. I'm going after some thugs. Seems like some people got their homes trashed. But no, I haven't seen them. Though I heard some other people talking about it. Okay, thanks. Hey. Who are you, young man? I can't help but notice. You've been wandering around here lately. My name is Ryo Hazuki. Ah, so you're Japanese. Sorry, dear. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I'm not too partial to strangers. Wait, Mrs. Jung. Oh, Shenhua. I didn't know you were here. This is Ryo. He's my friend. Oh. Well, why didn't you say so? Now, what can I do for you? I've got a question. Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Oh, yes. Those hooligans came here, too. What did they want? They seemed to be looking for something. They were turning the house inside out. In a mountain village like this, the only thing that has any value are the stones that Yuan carves. Could the thugs have taken my father? That's not the only possibility. Oh, really? Do you know where they went after that? 
No, dear. Your guess is as good as mine. They vanished without a trace. I see. Who else can we talk to? How about you? I need help with something. Huh? Mei Ling. Oh, hi, Shenhua. Were you a good girl today? Of course. Who's he, <coughs> Shenhua? This is Liu. He's a friend of mine. Did you see the thugs that came to the village? Oh. Mei Ling, did some scary looking guys come by? I don't know who it was, but someone was here last night. Can you tell me more? I heard a man's voice yelling. He was really loud. I got scared, so I hid under the covers. Next morning, I asked my mom and dad about what happened, but they said a kid like me doesn't have to worry about it. Hmm, okay. Maybe if you two ask mom, she'll tell you. Thanks a lot, Mei Ling. Liu, let's go talk to Wang Wen. Okay. All right, can I use this? All right. Oh, oh come on. Ah. No, holding it. It's like not even the same thing. All right. Excuse me. You're not from around here, are you? You're a Fang. This is a friend of mine. Um. Is that right? Hi there. Is Wang Wen around? <laughs> There's something I'd like to ask Wang Wen. She's not around. I was just talking to her. I see. She said something about going shopping, so maybe she already left for Talget. Got it. Thanks. All right, Talget. Is that where we want to go? What do these signs say? Can I read them? I should talk to more people nope. around here. All right. How about this house? Nope. All right. This still won't let me this way. I should talk to more people around here. All right. Who do I talk to? Is anyone there? Uh, it seems nobody's home. Is anyone there? Uh, looks like no one's home. All right. I need help with something. Yeah? Oh, hi, Shenhua. We want to talk to Mei Ling's mother. She left. Do you know where she is? She's a Talget. Okay, thanks. Are you and Shenhua leaving? Just dropping by. I want to go too. Your father will worry if you're not here. 
Okay. See you later. Alright, can we leave yet? Talk to enough people. We talked to all the grown-ups, I think, and a couple of the kids. We know where to go, so... Maybe I'll talk to a few nope. folks around here. Still not. Still can't leave. this door is anyone there uh, looks like no one's home I can't go that way hmm Maybe talk to some of these people. Hey, bud. Bud, over here. You can't play unless you buy some tokens. Okay. Buy some tokens if you want to play. No. How about you? Excuse me. Hello there. Welcome. Care for some lucky hit? This is circle one. No, no. thanks. I'd rather you play than talk. Circle one is so much fun. Not right. You're not going to play? All right, no, I'm not. I'm Let's heartbroken. Get out of here. Right, how about you? Do you talk something? Excuse me. Huh? You talking to me? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wanna have a drink with me? It's going on your Oh, he's just a drunk. Buddy. This guy's no help. Seems like you've already had a few. I'm just having a good... Alright. This... Hmm. Yeah, a turtle race or something. Interesting. Alright. Lucky hit. I'm too busy to play these games now. Come on, let's go. Excuse me. Huh? What is it? Hello, one. Senhua! This is my friend, Yo. Oh, really? Your friend? I'm looking for some thugs. Have you seen any? One. Did the thugs show up here? That they did. But my husband drove them off. He's really good to have around in times like these. What did they want? That's what I'd like to know. They kept hollering something about wanting to meet the stonemason. I was inside and didn't see anything. My husband told me about it after it was over. I see. Let's talk to Shiren, one's husband. Good idea. Thanks again. Thanks, one. All right, is that him? Hi there. I've heard about you. You're Shenhua's friend, aren't you? Can't the be. name's Hazuki. Oh, oh, you look strong. Um, a young man like you needs a snake power. It's a bottle of snake power. Why this? Deadly snake venom fermented for three months. It's just one of the medicines that'll help you in battle. It'll fix you up good. I see. 
I think. I always sell it here at my shop, in case you forget. Alright. Alright, where's the husband? Not him, is it? Hello? Uh. Ah, nobody's ever home. Hi there. What is it? Oh, not her again. Come on. Ah, uh, cancel like out. Is he? He's on watch duty at the Verdant Bridge this time of day. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks. One of the guys at the bridge. Oh, there's only one here now. Okay. Hello, Leo. Da Tong. What's with the two of you? Is Wong Shiren around? I'd like to talk to Shiren. He left to patrol Long Weishan. It's up ahead. You'll see signs <coughs> for it. I see. All right. This way, huh? Which way is it? All right. Looks like I can practice horse dance here. Hmm. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. It's not what I came here for. Ah, uh, give it a shot. Horse dance, huh? Maybe I'll give it a shot. Wow, okay. <laughs> oh, what am I supposed to do? Tap? Okay. enough for one day. Alright, let's get out of this. How do I... Do I have to fail? How long does this go on? Okay. I guess... Should I guess I that's good going? enough for now. No, not now. Alright. Never mind. No, I said something about a sign. Ah. No. I could practice my one inch punch. Ah, oh, the one inch punch. Sure. I'll give it a shot. Alright, I'll give it a shot. One inch punch. Maybe I'll give it a shot. Alright, how do you do it? Give me a clue. How do you do it?
Ah, oh, that was a bad one. Ugh, oh, come on. Okay, that's enough. Maybe I'll practice some more? No, not now. I'll save it for later. Alright, there's a sign. I think I was back up to Shenhua's house, so... Verdant Bridge, here it is. Languishan. There you are. Excuse me. What do you want? What are you two doing here? Uh, there's something I want to ask. I'm looking for some thugs. Have you seen any? Did you see two of them the other night? Yeah, a big man with long hair, and a man with a shaved head and a spider tattoo. Tell me more. They barged in during the middle of the night when I was sleeping. They kept yelling this and that about a stonemason. I told them they had the wrong house and drove them off. Then I went right back to bed. Is there anybody else? Do you know where they went after that? That I don't know. But I do know that there were other witnesses. A man I met at the bar was talking about it. He was a bookie with a scar on his face. What kind of scar? A big one. Uh, on his cheek. We should talk to him, Leon. Yes. Let's go find him. All right. Well, I think I'll go save it. I'm close to her house. All right, let's go up here. This is the way, right? Okay. Spot with a view here. Can I sit? Maybe not. Oh, some more licorice. Yeah, too bad I can't just sit here. Look, there's the bell tower in the village. Nice view up here. Ah! Oh, I don't know if I'm going the right way anymore. Could this really be... Oh, man. Did I go the wrong way down there? Rest the house. Okay. Isn't that the Shenmue tree? Get rid of the swing. Uh oh. Hmm. Okay, let's take a rest at the house. It's time to save and quit. Maybe we'll continue this next time.